Half-Life has released a big 25th anniversary update that includes four new multiplayer maps and much, much more. Right after this. Another thing that has been added is Half-Life Uplink. It used to be part of content that was sent out on CDs and magazines, the demo of Half-Life, and now included in the actual game, along with four new multiplayer maps. Some of the bugs have been fixed as well. Three of the maps that are being included were originally available on disc called Half-Life Further Data. You can even go ahead and play Half-Life in widescreen without having to use mods or fan remakes, as it will be part of the base game. Valve went on to say, Half-Life turns 25 this weekend. We're pushing a big update to bring back some of that 1998 feeling. We'll restore the original launch date content, brand new multiplayer maps, a look behind the scenes within the original development team, and much more. Now at this time, the anniversary edition will be the definitive version of Half-Life and will get support from Valve going forward. Even went on to add, we launched Half-Life on November 19th, 1998. We are very proud of what we built back then and we remain extremely grateful for the community of players who have been enjoying it ever since. The game hasn't received as much attention in recent years as many other titles in our catalog, so we thought the milestone was a great opportunity to spruce up the player experience and add some fun new ways to play the game. I think it's time to turn off these videos about Half-Life, including this one, load up the game and start playing it either on a PC or even on your Steam Deck. But until more updates come out, keep on gaming. That's it for this one. Hope you all enjoy. Take care. See you all in the next one.